Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Activities for People Living at Home with Dementia. We are proud to offer this series with funding from the Area Agency on Aging and the United Way of Tarrant County. These programs are recorded and are made available for viewing through a YouTube channel for future use. Mm. If you haven't gone back and looked at some of those YouTubes, they are cool. I am Martha Brown, your host for today's activities. I am going to give us a Jeopardy game today. Whoopee! Woohoo! Okie dokie. Let's see if I can get from here to there. <laughs> And I need to share the screen again, right? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Do y'all see part of it in fuzzy? Yes. You see yep. fuzzy? We need part four teams. There you go. We need four teams. That's right. I'm going to move us to the bottom. Okay. We're not going to edit. I need to move this up so we can see more. Four teams. Start. There you go. Mm -hmm. Movies from the 30s to the 50s. Oh, Martha. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, Heather, they weren't in the U.S. back then. <laughs> so that's always harder for them. I'm trying. We weren't born back then. Yeah. Uh, th th these are things we watch on Turner Classic Movies, I think. Okay. Okay. Movies from the 60s to the 70s. Theater, which Hans and Yetta might enjoy, music, and classic television. Wow, okay. Woo! And there are some double jeopardies in there because we added them at the last minute. Do you see, you don't see this bird, do you? He's, yes. Yes. We see, him, we see him on the side screen. Okay, he's just checking. I think he wants to play. He wanted to play big theater. Which one do that the classic. Team. Okay, team one is Don and Myra. Where would you like to start? Let's go to classic television for 500, please. Classic television for 500, team one. Teacher, Brooklyn, Sweat Hogs. Was this room 222 or Welcome Back, Cotter? Welcome back, Carter. Let's see. Yep. What is welcome back, Carter? Team one you know, gets points. You know, this calling this classic TV makes me feel old. Isn't it? <laughs> I totally agree with you. I totally agree with you. <laughs> yeah, and Hans, team two, where would you like to go? Hans wants music for 500. Music for 500, and I don't blame him. Music is cool. Okay, these songs. <laughs> Bring it on home to me, Chain Gang, or a change is going to come. Was it Sam <laughs> Cooke or Marvin Gaye? And I don't know the answer to this one. This Can is we throw, I throw a dice? Throw a dice. Yes, team two, throw a dice. We have no clue. Well, you have a 50% chance. That's what I was just about to say. 50-50 yeah. shot. Chance. What do you want to pick, Hans? <laughs> and nobody else knows either, so don't feel bad. No, we don't. No. We no. don't. Not even I do. I don't even know the, the music or the, the melodies or whatever. Working on the chain gang. <laughs> That's it all. doesn't I know. help. <laughs> Which one else? <laughs> Sam or Marvin? Marvin. Marvin. We'll try Marvin. Let's see. Oh, who oh. Took? well, that 50% didn't do it, but there will be others, right? Yep. Right. Yes. And double jeopardy. <laughs> Team three, Nancy and Steve. Who wants to pick first? Okay, Nancy, what would you like? Um, movies, 500. Okay, movies for 500. You want 30s to 50s or 60s to 70s? No, movies. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's okay. Which one, Nancy? Uh, 30, 50s. 30s to 50s. 30s, 50s. Okay. And you want 500. Okie dokie. Girl, horse, grand national race. Was this National Velvet or Secretariat Team 3? The movie uh, from the 30s, 40s, and 50s, if that helps. Uh, um, I think that was Elizabeth Taylor's National Velvet. Wasn't national it? Velvet. 
Don't you think? Yes, it nope, will. Nope. You are right. right. Good job. Good job. Yeah. That's uh, come on, Martha. Got to get him some points. That, that's at the bottom of the screen, and it's a little hard to get to. Hold on. There. Yo. Yes. All righty. Let's see. Team four, Phil and Paulette, where would you like to start? Uh, movies, 60s and 70s, or theater? Movies. Movies, 60s to 70s for 500. Okie dokie. Team four, Phil and Paulette. 1962, rock and roll, Fonzie, Ron Howard. Was it Happy Days or Back to the Future, Team Four? Well, that was Happy Days. Happy days. Yes, it was. Yep. It yep. was Happy Days, Team Four. Do you get extra points if you sing the theme song? No. <laughs> we don't, we don't, it was sing. Monday, Tuesday, Happy Days. <clears throat> <laughs> Team one, Don and Myra, where would you like to go? Whatever. Let's try theater for 500. Theater for 500. Willie Loman, poor family, well liked movie. Was it Death of a Salesman or Rear Window? Team one. Um, I, I remember. Rear window, and that's had Jimmy Stewart in it. So I'm going to say Death of a Salesman. That's a good deduction. Let's see. Yes, it was Death of a Salesman. Oh. Woohoo! Team one. There you go. Yeah. All righty. Team two. Which one do you want, Hans? Hans Yetta. Which one do you want? This one? Or that one? This one. Movies 60s to 70s for four. All righty. Movies 60s, 70s for 400. Team two, Yetta and Hans. Benjamin, Mrs. Robinson, and Plastics. <laughs> <laughs> Was it Bedford Falls or The Graduate, Team two? The Graduate. Right. Yes, it was The Graduate, Team two. I was going to say on a scale of one to 10, that level of confidence was about a 14 on that answer. Well, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Good. They're hot. That's right. Okie dokie. <laughs> Team three, Steve and Nancy. Steve. It's okay, Nancy. Let's, 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 uh, I don't know. Steve let's do classic TV for 400. Okay. All right. Classic TV for 400. Team three. Detectives, crime, LA, 1950s. Just the facts, ma'am. Was it <laughs> L.A. Law or Dragnet, Team 3? Dragnet. Yep. Nancy agreed. Oh, yeah. Yes, yeah. it was Dragnet. What gave it away? Uh, just, just the, the facts, facts ma'am. Ma <laughs> I'm glad because I added that in. It wasn't there. <laughs> okay, Phil and Paulette, Team 4. Uh, movies, theater, or music? Pick, you uh, let's do theater for 400. Okie dokie, theater for 400, team four. Oh. Double jeopardy. Oh. Oh. Woohoo! Okay, founding fathers, U.S., not a president, guy on the $10 bill. Was it Hamilton or Burr, team four? Uh, Hamilton. Alexander yeah. Hamilton. Mm -hmm. oh, woo. That's team four, and that's double jeopardy. So oh, yep. click that twice. All right. Ding. Who's got the ding? I like that. Oh, I did. Yay. I like that. <laughs> I'm Myra, team one. <clears throat> Where would you like? Um, let's go to movies from the 30s to 50s for 400. For 400, okay, team one, here we go. Movies from the 30s to 50s, 400. World War II, Morocco, gambling, romance. Was it Casablanca or African Queen, team one? Casablanca. What is Casablanca? Yay. Right. Team one wins points. Good deal. Okay. You're the team to beat. They are. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah, they are. I don't know. Team four's got, got the double jeopardy. They're pretty good. They're hot pretty. on your heels. Yeah. That's right. Uh -huh. 
team two. Which one do you want, Tim? I don't know. We don't know. We'll. Uh, oh, geez. Um, Oh, baby. Uh, you pick. Oh, I have no clue. Movies 60s to 70s, both we. Okay, movies 60s to 70s. Team, let's see, for 300, team two. Double Jeopardy. Oh! Oh! Get a chance here. Boxer, Italian Stallion, Philadelphia. Was it Horse Whisperer or Rocky, team two? Rocky. What is Rocky? There you go. There you go. Good job. You boost. Double Jeopardy there. Yeah. I see a trend when someone says, <laughs> I don't know, you pick, then there's the your, there's your double Jeopardy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing a pattern emerge. Good for you, Heather. Thank you for observing that. <laughs> That's I don't a- know. You pick, Steve. <laughs> oh, I pick. Huh? Yeah. Team well, three. let's just try the music for 400, see how bad we do. Okay. It, nobody wants <laughs> 400. <laughs> okay. Music for 400, team three. Folsom Prison, I Walk the Line, Ring of Fire, Man in Black. Is this Clint Eastwood or Johnny Cash, team three? Johnny Cash. Yep. Johnny Cash. Johnny Cash, team three. <laughs> there you go. Y'all are just getting a bit better and consistent all the time. These okay. numbers are looking good on that scoreboard. Yeah. Woohoo! <clears throat> We're all winners. Team four, Paulette and Phil. Where would you like to go? The movies, <clears throat> theater, music, or classic television. Probably. I'm gonna say movies. Uh, movies in 1930s to 1950s for 300. Okie dokie. Movies, 30s to 50s for 300, team four. Double Jeopardy. Double Jeopardy, all right. (laughs) We're spreading it around today. Tycoon, newspaper, sled. Is it Citizen Kane or Howard Hughes, the man, team four? Citizen Kane. Kane. Where's Rosebud? Where's Where's Rosebud? Where's Rosebud? That's correct. Do you remember what Rosebud was? No. What was it? Sled. The sled. The sled. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I should have made that rosebud instead of the sled. I should have. That's right. Congratulations. You got double jeopardy on that. And by the way, uh, Al, Heather, we, we don't take away points here. Uh huh. We just add. <laughs> I like your math. I do too. Team one, Myra and Don, where would you like to go? Classical TV for 300. Classical TV for 300, team one. Hmm. Medical unit, Korea Hmm. more funny and sad. Was it Saving Private Ryan or MASH, team one? It was MASH. What is MASH, team one? Favorite show. Hmm. Favorite show? Mm -hmm. That was good. Well, good. good Oh, it was great. Did did you? It was, yeah. Ellen Alda. Yep. Did y'all mm-hmm. all tune in for the ending? Yes. yes. Mm-hmm. Do you remember where you were? No. Oh. No, we're in our house. Under the TV. <laughs> Under the TV. Yeah. That's right. Those are good answers. Aren't they? The too? living room. Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Team two, Yetta and Hans, where would you like to go? I prefer theater over the music. Theater, theater for 300, I'm guessing. Mm-hmm. Okay, team two, here we go. Governess, big family, Austria, World War II. Was it Mary Poppins or Sound of Music? And I'm sorry if this one is not a very good question. Sound of Music. Absolutely the Sound of Music. Team two gets points there. Oh, yep. my word. <laughs> Yay. Okay, Steve and Nancy, team three. How about Nancy? What do you want? Uh, music 300. Music for 300. Music for 300, team three. My Way, Strangers in the Night, and Rat Pack. Is it Sammy Davis Jr. or Frank Sinatra? I'm going to say Frank Sinatra. How about you, Nancy? Uh, Rat Pack. Yes, Frank Sinatra. 
Frank Sinatra. It is yep. Frank Sinatra. And I apologize for this one because Sammy Davis Jr. was part of the Rat Pack. Right, he was, but that's But right. he didn't sing My Way or Strangers in the Night. Right. Thank God he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> but he did kiss Archie Bunker on the cheek. He did. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we have a wide open, pick any of them, Paulette. Wide <laughs> open. Paulette, pick the next one. Team four. What category. Movies, theater. Yep. Classic. Music or classic TV. I don't know. You, you select. I don't care. Let's do theater for 200. Theater for 200, team four. Opera House, Supernatural, Mask. Is this the Adams Family or Phantom of the Opera, team four? That's uh, Phantom of the Opera. Yes. Actually, Paulette played Christine one time at a Halloween party. We oh, oh, really? Yes. Right. Were you the Phantom? <laughs> yeah, were you the Phantom, Phil? Were you the I Phantom? was. He was. Oh, very good. <laughs> <laughs> Title role. <laughs> I hope you took pictures. That sounds awesome. Doesn't it? I actually have a picture. I'll go see if I can find it. Oh, good. <laughs> okay. okay. I know. He's going to go check it out. <laughs> we, love, we love pictures. Team one, Don and Myra, where would you like to go? Classic TV for 200, please. Classic t <clears throat> TV for 200, team one. Mm -hmm. Creepy, kooky, mysterious, and spooky. Casper the Friendly Ghost or the Adams Family, team one. The Adams Family. Da -da -da -da. The Adams That's Family. Right. <laughs> Team one, that's yep. right. Yeah. Give those people some points. <laughs> <laughs> Okie dokie, team two, Hans and Yetta. Well, movies in the 60s to 70s. Okay. Or two. Movies from the 60s and 70s, 200, team two. Nanny, London, Chimney Sweep. Was it the Nanny or Mary Poppins, team two? Mary Poppins. Yep. Who is Mary Poppins? Team two gets points. Just a spoonful of sugar. <laughs> That's mm -hmm. right. And but we can all sing that one, can't we? Mm -hmm. I remember her bag that just she keeps pulling oh, all yeah. kinds yeah. of things out. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. I always wondered was wondered what kind of special effects they had to make that that possible. <laughs> I mean, That's the truth. And carpet bags. I don't understand carpet bags. Was that because they couldn't afford leather? No, carpet bags were know. probably pretty common during the time frame that the movie was made, in the setting that the movie was made. Yeah. Gotcha. Maybe, maybe I'll, I'll learn something. I'll look that one up. <laughs> Team three, Nancy and Steve. Who's going to pick next? What, what do you want, Steve? Uh, let's do movies, 1930s to 50s. Okay. Okay, team three, movies, 30s to 50s. You want 200, right? Yes. <clears throat> okay. Dorothy, Toto, mm -hmm. and Red Slippers. Was it The Red Shoes or Wizard of Oz, team three? We're not in Kansas anymore. <laughs> Wizard of Oz. Wizard of Oz, team That's three. Right. That's right. We are not in Kansas mm -hmm. anymore. Maybe we should all in unison click our heels together. Ding, ding. I want to go home. Oh, There's wait. No place right like home. There's no place like home. <laughs> right. Okay. Sorry. No, that's okay. We're, we're having fun. Team four. Mm -hmm. yeah. Team four, Paulette and Phil. What are we doing? Selecting something? Uh huh. Let me take music for 200. Music. Okay. Let's do music for 200, team four. <clears throat> and I brought my frog today. Blowing in the wind, like a rolling stone, shelter from the storm. Was this Bob Dylan or James Taylor, team four? Bob Dylan. Bob Dylan. Bob Dylan, team yep. four. Got it. All yep. right. You got the answer. Thank you. Yay. All right. Team one, we're coming into the home stretch. Do classic TV for 100. Classic TV for 100. Bar, Boston, Sam Malone, basement. Was it Seb's Place or Cheers, Team One? Cheers. Yes, Cheers. 
What is cheers, team one? We'll get you some points here for that. Awesome. All right, team two, Yetta and Hans. Debbie Freeman. That one, movies, 60s to 70s. Okay. Oh, team one, that's not us. We just did one. We did oh, one. You just it's did. Okay, turn. so it is us. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I lose my place sometimes too. I, yeah, thank you for being right there with me. Okay, Yetta and Hans, movies from the 60s and 70s for 100. Corleone Family, Mafia, An Offer You Can't Refuse. Was it Rocky or The Godfather? Team two. Godfather. What is The Godfather? Team two. Get some points there. Good job, good job. Good yeah. job. That's right. For not to have been in the U.S. during both of those time periods, that's wonderful. Team mm -hmm. three, Steve and Nancy. What do you think, Nancy? Any card, any card. You guess. Uh, 30, movies, 30s, 90s. Movies from the 30s to the 50s for 100, team three. Scarlet, Rhett, Civil War. Was it Glory or Gone with the Wind, team three? Gone with gone the wind. wind. What is gone with the wind? Team three. Click like clicking your heels together. That's right. <laughs> There's a high level of confidence with that answer, too. Yeah. Did you know that there was a there was a prequel that came out um, about 15 years ago called Scarlet. Oh. No. Mm -hmm. It's if you have an opportunity to look it up, maybe on I don't know if it would be on Netflix or Hulu or but Scar if you enjoy Gone with the Wind, you might also enjoy Scarlet. It's a prequel to it. So okay. it shows leading up to the beginning of I didn't know that. No. That's no. the first movie that they allowed a curse word in. Yes. Was really? it the very first one? Very first yes. one. Yes. Frankly, I don't give a damn. Yep. Exactly. Oh. Frankly, my dear. <laughs> yes, that's right. Mm -hmm. Okie dokie, Phil and Paulette, team four. Do theater for 100. Theater for 100, team four. Montagues, Capulets, Feuding, Star Crossed Lovers. Is this Romeo and Juliet or the Magic Flute, team four? You know the answer to that, Paulette? Romeo and Juliet, I promise. Romeo and Juliet. Yes, yes it is, yep. Paulette. Yes, it is. Team four gets points. All right. Awesome. Good, good lady. Okay, Don, where would you and Myra like to? <laughs> well, um, I guess we'll do music for 100 then. Music for 100, team one. She loves you. Help, Sergeant Pepper. Is this the Beach Boys or the Beatles, team one? It's, it is the Beatles. It is the Beatles, team one. Wow. Boy, we have some high numbers today. Look yeah. at We did. Let's see. Team four came in with 2,400. Team they, got both, they got both double jeopardies. Yeah, they That's did. Right. Okay. Oh, that'll do it every time. Yep, yep. Team one. Well, we, we had one. We got oh, one. that's right. Okay. There were three. Yes. There okay. Were three. Yes. Team one came in at 2,100. Team three sneaked in at 1,900, and team two comes up from the rear at 1,600. Not, hey. shabby. Yeah. Not shabby. Woo. Good job, everybody. Good job. Good job. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Yeah. It was a lot of fun. And look at that. We're almost early today. I guess after we start our second and third series, we'll have to be a little more mindful of time, but that was a did a good job. Yeah. Thank yeah. you for letting me do that today. That was fun. Oh, that was fun. Thank you. Yeah. We'll do it again. <laughs> yes. And Yetta and Hans, yeah. I, I will do my best to stop putting in stuff you don't know. No, no. <laughs> no, mean, no. You could see no. some of it with you. You did, yeah. I, I mean, the <laughs> movies are played all over the world. So, yeah. and, and theater, well, you know, don't do not do that, Martha. But the one that they missed was very difficult. That, that was, was the most difficult of all the questions. Yeah. That was the one nobody knew. Yeah, yeah that, that was the same. No idea who it was and what the music was. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. Stumped us all. It did. Well, let's take a look at what's coming up. Okay. Okay. Get us some purple here. That was That's blue. 
That's blue. No, blue. Okay. Today. Oh, sorry. Pretty. Sorry. <laughs> tomorrow, and we did not have cookies, but we will on the 18th. Tomorrow is Peggy Spear from the America, uh, Eamon Carter Museum of American Art. She will bring us art about movie theaters. I'm really hoping for something old. I hope she does that. And then Thursday, Emily Corbin is doing chair yoga or Nia moving to. <laughs> I hope she has her music fixed by then, but it's easy. Yeah. It's even okay without music. Yep. It was more meditative last week, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Yes, it was. And I needed it. Friday, oh boy, Graham Jones, vocalist and guitar. I'm so glad Texas Winds is back and they will be with yep. us all year. Yep. And then we start all over again next Monday with Frog Bingo. So there you go. Okay. All yeah. right. Yes. What do y'all have to share before we go today? Uh, the Texas Bowl is playing tonight, Kansas State versus LSU. Kansas we'll State. Two K-State shirts oh, on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it just so happens that that color matches the Alzheimer's Association t-shirt yep. every year. That's right. And uh, the, the, the LSU has a very big disadvantage because uh, a, a lot of their good players on the offense have are sidelined with COVID. So... Mm -hmm. um, we won't take advantage of that much, not. <laughs> By the way, I finally got my T-shirt from the okay. wall two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. Saturday, Saturday is the uh, championship game for the F FCS conference. Oh, yeah. NCAA. It's in Frisco. Okay. North, North Dakota Good State, way. Montana State. Okay. Who are we rooting for, Steve? North Dakota State. Okay. Of course, North Dakota State. Yeah. <laughs> but it's going to be interesting because the coach from Montana State came from North Dakota State. Uh, well, oh, that you know, kind of stuff. So they're sharing coaches, and these, these teams are getting better because, you know, the, the, the philosophy is expanding out. It is. It's yeah. kind of a unique approach. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to see Dear Evan Hansen Saturday at the Bass. That's my big deal. Mm -hmm. Good deal. Good for you. Yeah. yeah. What was the name of it, uh, Martha? Dear Evan Hansen. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's about a boy who gets his arm broken, and I don't know the storyline other than that. Uh, isn't that a movie also? I don't know. It probably is. I don't know. I, I, I can't tell you because I'm, I'm ignorant okay. about that. Okay. So maybe you can figure that out, and we'll know next I'll time. figure that out, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Our, our other grandson, Mark, was supposed to be with us next week, but the baby. Rebecca's got COVID, so they're not coming. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Goodness. Well, God bless her. I hope she doesn't have a bad case. Well, she doesn't seem to be bad, but you know, she can't go back to work until she's clear. And so but right. they're paying her for it anyway. Yeah, that's good. You know, Best Buy is paying, you know, still paying her. <coughs> Good. Giving her a salary anyway, even though she can't work. That's yeah. wonderful. They even that's provided the COVID tests. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's a good so. company. And who does she work for? She works for Best Buy. Best Buy. And her, yeah. and her husband works for Disney, right? Right. Yeah. And so far, he's been fine. Now, they're, he's not been tested. They're going to do a test on Thursday. But they got to drive 70 miles to get it. Yeah, Ooh, so yeah. the testing is very limited these days. Yes, we want them healthy. I was hearing that the hospitalization numbers are the things to watch these days. Yeah, and they're going up. Yeah, we went they're up to they're up to almost a hundred thousand a day. Yeah, something. Uh, they said they even said up. even Children's Hospital is really yeah yeah you know, up. So. Yes. New York City went from 1% to 16% in the matter of two weeks. Yep. That's scary. <coughs> Hear of one another. I'll see you all tomorrow. All right. All right. Martha, thank Bye. you so Adios, much. Have a good day. Bye. 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 Bye.